Hello, my name is Jim Murphy. I'm coordinator of the Passadrest Maritime Museum. Uh, this is a model of the paddle steamer, the Sirius. She was built in Scotland. It was 54 metres, 180 feet in length and was powered by two cylindrical engines. She was on a regular passenger run Cork to London and Bristol. Uh, the Sirius is also called uh, the Dog Star and here you have the, the model maker put in the little model of the do uh, uh, dog. At that time, the uh, race to get across the Atlantic faster and safer generated a lot of rivalry. The Great Western Rail Company decided to build a ship called the Great Western uh, for that purpose. An Irish uh, American company based from Cork with a number of Cork businessmen decided to enter the, that race and were building a ship called the British Queen. Now they had some problems with that ship and to still get their nose in front in the race, they hired a smaller, lot smaller vessel, P.S. Sirius. In 1838, the paddle steamer P.S. Sirius left Passage West Commanded by Passman Captain Richard Roberts, the P.S. Sirius, 18 days later, arrived in New York on the 22nd of April, uh, about 20 hours in front of the Great uh, Western, to become the first ship to cross the Atlantic entirely under steam. Captain Roberts, because of the, uh, the achievement of the Sirius, he became the captain in demand. He captained the British Queen when she was uh, went there on her maiden voyage. He then got command of the President and he crossed the Atlantic again and on the way back she anchored in a storm and disappeared. Here we have uh, some uh, books and artefacts and photographs of Sirius and the Roberts family kindly donated a lot of models and materials to us here and gives a lot of help setting up the museum.